What did you have your quarterbacks do and what did you learn? From yeah, them? you know, we weren't able to go quarterbacks live, so it, it kind of, you don't get a chance to really get a great feel, but how they uh, ran the offense, how they communicated, I mean, that's really what we'll look at as far as execution. Like I said, there wasn't a lot of, of long drives, you know, so uh, it was more of how a team responds to them, you know, and how we respond to the adversity on the sideline. Mikey D, when you look at him, maybe even versus the spring, is he a different quarterback? What, what have you seen maybe specifically about Mike? Yeah, I mean, you can just tell he's a year uh, advanced and he understands concepts, he understands situations. You know, true freshman, you're learning as you go situations and he got a better feel for that. And, uh, you know, so he's continuing to improve. You said the quarterbacks weren't lives. Right. Does that limit what John Ray Homley can showcase? Well, I mean, obviously he can make plays with his feet. So you strate strategically, you do best you can about when you think he would, would be down and when he when he would. So uh, that's that's the challenge. But uh, you know, we can still learn quite a bit from what we see. Your timeline for naming star is that still pretty fluid with how you, things progress? You know, what we what our offensive staff said, I mean, let's get through the first two scrimmages and then that's for everybody. And then we'll kind of see where we're at. And you know, like I said, my experience is, you know, usually that the whole team knows who the starting quarterback needs to be. Okay, now we'll see if that happens. Um, but right now, I'm not just putting a date down with it. Would the next scrimmage close with the quarterbacks be live or maybe move forward? Yeah, I haven't decided yet. I mean, I, I, you know, before I'd say no, but you, you never know. You never know.